Howdy everybody, it's your pal Misty. Sit back, relax, and enjoy uh, while I just talk about some stuff. So today I'm actually at work. I was not called into the office, however, I had a presentation that I was asked to do and it's much easier to do with two monitors, which I have already set up here and I live 10 minutes away from work. So this afternoon I decided I'm just gonna go in, do my presentation. And then I thought, well, I'm kinda hungry. And it was about two o'clock, 1.30 actually, 1.30. And I was kinda hungry. And I didn't wanna make food and I didn't wanna bring food. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do a keto fast food today. So for those of you who are doing keto, and you find yourself in a situation where you're kind of stuck and fast food is the only thing, which was not my situation, but you know, I'm here to help you. <laughs> and I wanted a treat uh, since I thought about it. I wasn't thinking about it beforehand, but once I thought about it, I couldn't get it out of my head. So all I did was I stopped by Wendy's. I got a side salad or a garden salad, I believe they call it, a garden salad and a junior bacon cheeseburger. Now you're like, Misty, you can't have a hamburger. You're on keto. You're right, I can't. So what did I do? I took the lettuce, the meat, and the cheese off of the cheeseburger, crumbled it all up, took the bacon, swapped all the mayonnaise off the <laughs> bun, <laughs> crumbled it all up, and then it comes with ranch. Uh, Wendy's also has a Caesar salad. Caesar is also a really low carb dressing that you could use on the keto diet. Uh, so the little, actually I have another one because they gave me two. So I was gonna take this one home to have just another on the go ranch packet. So all of this ranch in this packet, it is a little over an ounce, was only two carbs. Not bad for a salad. You'll have a few more carbs in that. Now, it did come with tomatoes on both the hamburger and the salad. Tomatoes are a little bit high in carbs, but you can still definitely fit them into your day. However, um, raw tomatoes and me don't agree. Cooked tomatoes seem to be okay on limit limited okay. <laughs> I can't eat a lot of it, but like a sauce on a pizza normally doesn't cause me any problems with my skin condition that I have. But I don't like tomatoes either. So not only that, it's a good thing they don't like me because you know what? I don't like them either. Mm -hmm. So I took off all the tomatoes and threw them away. Um, I actually like the Wendy salad. It's $2.29 so it's a little bit more expensive than the side salad you can get from like McDonald's. But to me it seems bigger. It always seems fresher. So, you may not have a Wendy's by you, but, you know, that if you do, that's one of the options. McDonald's, you can do kind of the same thing. McDonald's, I'll go and I'll get a side salad and normally a double cheeseburger with bacon, which is like $2 and then a dollar something for the side salad. So, it's going to average about three, you know, three fifty four dollars $4, but it'll give you a nice little meal to, to eat on the go. I'm waving at people as they leave. They know I do videos, so they don't think it's weird to see me sitting in a car talking to myself. Well, they may think it's weird, but they like me anyway and let me get away with it. Um, so, just thought I'd uh, let you know a, a little keto tip that sometimes if you go to fast food restaurants, doesn't mean you have to throw away the croutons. Uh-huh. Doesn't mean you have to throw away the delicious warm buns. Uh-huh. Was it really that hard to do? Not for me. Now, I know for other people it is harder to do that type of thing, but it didn't bother me none. I just threw them right away. I didn't want them. They weren't in my diet plan. And I'm feeling pretty great today. My back hurts. I hurt my back. I don't remember if I told you all that or not. Yeah, I did about moving the stupid box. I hurt my back. Anyway, so it's still a little iffy today, but it's better. Much better. And mentally, the clarity is starting to come back. I'm totally out of the fog. I feel like my brain is once again shooting on all cylinders. Hoping I don't get insomnia or anything like that. Um... Another thing which is also happening which is good and is way too much information but welcome to my channel where I tell y'all what's happening and you just listen. Um, I've been able to go to the restroom every single day. 
I'm so excited about that. Every day, like a normal, regular person. And I know that may not seem like a bunch, <laughs> or like a big concern to other people, but on keto, a lot of people get constipated, and being constipated, I've been there, and it hurts. And, you know, if you get to the point where you got to drink that liquid, oh, it works. But well, it is no fun. Not fun for a second. So, just FYI. <laughs> you don't want to have to get there if you don't need to. Uh, but, again, the times I was doing keto before, I wasn't doing the full keto. I was doing a modified keto uh, that was led by a doctor. Which, not dissing that at all it worked I felt good while I was on it it was just very strict and mentally not something that I am prepared to do again it was also even more expensive because you had to buy their foods and this way if I want to have a lemon oh a lemon vanilla wafer crisp from Adkins <laughs> it's the best thing I've ever had it was so delicious I made fun of somebody because she ate too, but I totally get it because the day was amazing. It was so good. I had to eat some salted uh, pecans after because <laughs> I had to get that taste out of my mouth or I felt like I could have ate another one too. But I just had like three or four pecans and I had four. It's not a three or four. I had four. It's an even thing. I'm sorry. Let me not even lie to you. Like I made you only do three. Mm -mm, no, I did four. I'm weird. You're welcome. To, to, to the Misty Show. So I'm starting to ramble and it's uh, time to go home trying to beat the crowd out and then work some more once I get there. But, you know, just a quick little trip today. Thought I'd give you all that a little update. Uh, like this video if you liked it. Uh, subscribe if you know how. Hit that bell notification so you'll know when I have other videos coming out. And comment down below. What is your favorite fast food keto meal? Um, or even if you have a restaurant that you like to go to and get a keto meal, um, one of my favorites for that would actually have to be like a steak with broccoli as a side, chilies, or, now Texas Roadhouse is also really close to me, but they have, um, man, the bread smells so good in there. It's like, a, that's really hard, so I prefer chilies, <laughs> even though Roadhouse may have a better steak, and, and chilies has better broccoli, so, Better broccoli, good steak, no bread smell, chilies. That'd be my um, not non-fast food recommendation. But if you have any recommendations, please comment down below. And until next time, I'll see y'all real soon.